What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. As you can see from the title, today's video is a bit different than what you're used to on the channel. So I recently got super back into jailbreaking my device um, and I kind of just wanted to show off what stuff I've been using, what tweaks I like. I'm going to be doing uh, free tweaks. I'm going to be doing paid tweaks. I'm going to be doing like convenient tweaks. So expect a bunch of new videos coming out around jailbreaking, different tweaks and stuff that you can do with it. But today I just want to talk about the top five free tweaks that you can get for your uh, iOS device. Um, specifically on iOS 13. So stick around to see my top five favorite tweaks. So before we get into this one, today's video actually is sponsored by Create Culture Co. So Create Culture is a streetwear brand. Um, they're trying to empower creators. So they reached out to me. They actually gave me a, a discount code, JBP Tech. So if you use that on their website, shopcreatecultura.com, which will be in the description below, um, you can get 10% off your full order. So they do all types of cool stuff. They have a lot of really cool designs. Um, the awareness tee, which actually supports breast cancer awareness. Um, all types of stuff, everything from hats, socks, hoodies, stickers, uh, sweatpants, all types of stuff. Um, so check out their site, shopcreateculture.com and get 10% off your order with JBP Tech. All right, so the first week I want to show you guys is called Zen HTML. So right here you see above my uh, icons here, I have the time, I have the weather, um, and then I have the date. I have that as well as this one on my front screen here, that boxed in time. Uh, it's kind of hard to see with that background. Um, but yeah, my lock screen, I have the box in time and then I have the date below that. So that's uh, made possible with Zen HTML. So if I go into settings here. So you can customize anything on your lock screen or your home screen. There's a ton of widgets you can get for it. Um, but if you go into this lock screen widget here, you can choose, uh, choose background or foreground. You can drag that around, place it wherever you want, and then you just have your exit or complete buttons. Um, but there's a ton of widgets you can get. These are all ones that I've installed. Um, and there's there's a bunch of really cool ones you can do. Uh, this one I was using the other day, it's like a split down the middle, your date and then your weather. Um, so there's all types of cool stuff you can do with that. And then, like I said, you can do it on your lock or your home screen as well. So that was a really cool one. It kind of just switches up the whole vibe of your phone instead of just having your standard time on the top of the screen um, like you do usually on your lock screen. You can change it to pretty much whatever you want on that. So um, Zen HTML is a huge one. Again, completely free. So that one's one I would definitely check out. And the repo for that one, as well as all the following ones, is going to be in the description. So just head down there. I'll have the repos for you um, so you can add those to your Cydia or Zebra or whatever you're using. The next one is going to be Multipla. So I don't remember. I don't think this one's in here. Oh, yeah, right here. So with Multipla, this is a free video and I just have the light version, which is free. You can get um, the paid version, which is just Multipla, not Multiple Light. Um, the paid version just allows you to do more stuff, add more stuff. But mine is right here. So see how it says apps right there. If I swipe, I can go to my music. So if I have something playing, um, it's just, so if I have something playing on my phone, let me shut that up before I get copywritten. Um, that will show up right down here. So it's super convenient. If you're on your phone and you just want to switch songs or pause it real quick or whatever, just a quick swipe over, you can click play pause or next. Um, so that's super cool. And then if you get the paid version, it just allows you to add more there. Um, so you can do, let's see if it says, it. oh yeah, you can do your battery widget, you can do a weather widget, the music widget, which we already have. So it's pretty cool. Um, that one's super convenient. It's nice to have, you can just swipe over, control your music from there. And then the next one is called Saw. So, Saw in the settings, it's literally just enable and then hide home bar and that's it. What it does is it shrinks the bottom uh, section of your phone on all on, on pretty much any application. So usually this bar is, I want to say almost twice the size. It just kind of shrinks down that bottom bar and gets rid of that usual bar that's there showing you where to swipe up. 
you've had your phone for a while now you i mean most of you have anyway um you know where to swipe up from everybody knows where to swipe up from you don't need that little indicator down bottom so it just makes everything a little bit smaller it works in really any application if i go into twitter that uh bottom icon bar is just a little bit smaller than usual so it's nice to have um it just makes everything you know a little bit more room on your screen for everything that you're looking at which is super nice and then after that we have axon so if i go into settings so this one all doesn't give you too many options um you can enable it disable it obviously haptic feedback um, dark mode which i've had issues using dark mode so if you do get axon um, i would recommend having dark mode disabled because it doesn't seem to work well with dark mode on um but yeah that's all all i've did to that was enabled it and i have haptic feedback and what that is is on your lock screen your notifications look a lot cooler so instead of them being listed um like usual now let me turn this brightness down one more time for you instead of being them listed down bottom like usual it gives you a, a straight across row like this you can, you can scroll through them and then if you click them it shows you those normal notifications um and then you just sorry click them and it'll go away or if you want to get rid of them hold down on that icon you can clear all home notifications so just for that app or you can just clear all notifications in general um so yeah it's kind of cool you can also do the normal swipe away but it's just a matter of click that it shows up and it disappears if you have a bunch it will um, group them kind of like it's usually does on your screen um, but then you just click them and it lists all those for you. So super cool. It just kind of makes things look nice and different. Um, that's why you jailbreak your device. Usually you want it to look unique. So that one right there just makes it look super cool rather than your standard notifications. And then lastly, I have shuffle. Um, so this one, this one is crucial. I pretty much install this right away when I jailbreak. Now this one just puts this section right here at the top of your uh, settings so usually the airplane mode and everything is right there but this one gives you a tweak section an app section and a system app section so usually that stuff is all down here but if you just want to access your tweaks quicker they're all going to be inside this little uh, uh, area right here your normal apps that you've downloaded for your phone and then your system apps so like your facetime your messages stuff like that um, so it just makes it super convenient whenever you add a tweak, you know, it's going to go right into that folder. You don't have to scroll all the way down to the bottom of settings to access it. It's just way more convenient. Um, so yeah, like I said, all the repos for these five that I just listed for you are listed down below. Just add those repos to your Cydia or your Zebra or whatever you're using. Um, and then you can download these tweaks. So these are my top five free tweaks. Thank you guys for watching. I am going to have a top five convenient tweaks video very soon, as well as a top five paid tweaks video. So uh, subscribe, please, if you like those. We're almost at 500 subscribers. So please, please, please hit that subscribe button. Let's hit that thousand soon. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a good day. Peace.